Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to another train simulator live stream. Let's get on to the game. Uh, there we go, let's restart that as well and then we can see the thing. Hopefully everyone's all well this afternoon. We are in the class 73 today, running on the Brighton mainline, which is going to be fun. Um, Glenn did request for something slam door, so well, the 73 was like 2 quid or something like that. So I thought, yeah, let's get it. Uh, anyway, let's see what we have in the chat. We have got... Uh, New Order Bus, Mr. Coco, Glenn, Gordon, Sebastian, Devon, Pep, Laserjet, Daniel, uh, Northern Rail, Forbidden, uh, King, Cara, NS, um, we've got Glenn, Glenn will be happy, um, hopefully everyone's all, hello Sam as well, yeah I only just got up around half an hour ago so still waking up, hello Sam how are you, anyway you're being rerouted on the slow line via Red Tilt, engineering works on the fast lines will be taking place all morning so expect busier traffic on your reroute, switch cabs and open the doors for passengers here at Gatwick Airport to board, um, what are we in at the moment then? <clears throat> Wait, yeah, why, are we, why do we need to switch cabs? Uh, what are we on? Platform 1 we're on. Um, well, I sort of want to be in the... I want to be in the 73. If we're changing cabs, then we're not going to be in it. So let's come out of there. Hello, Blue Tech, how are you? Get some routes in, get some routine inside you. Uh, yeah, let's let's go back into that. Let's do actually one in the seventy three. So that wasn't really in the seventy three, was it? Hello, Pep. How you doing? Yeah, it was good. Uh, up up to you, Les. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, Southeastern. Hello, night tracks. It sure is the Gatwick Express. Hey, Amanda. How you doing? Right, good morning. You'll be sh you'll be driving the Gatwick Express service to Gatwick Airport, used by holiday goers to ensure they don't miss their flights. It's not really much faster than Southern services. Open the doors to allow passengers on board and then depart promptly. Let's not make these time-conscious passengers nervous. There it is. It's brilliant. Uh, is the webcam a bit? Let me quickly uh, roll that over a bit. Seems a bit... Yeah, that's, uh, that's a bit better. Apologies to the hair, it's all still wet. <laughs> it was only about 10 minutes ago I washed it. Um, let's uh, pop that up. Cool. Uh, headlights. Let's get them on. Yeah, I think that'll do. Yeah, how is everyone doing? Hopefully everyone's all well. There's Amanda, how are you as well? What is today's CSW route going to be? No clue. Oh, blimey, King Carrot. Exactly, no tracks here. Yeah. It's not really worth it. Oh, you only stop it. Well, you only miss out pretty much two stops. See Clapham and East Croydon. Right, all passengers are boarded. This train will now go fast to Gatwick. Cool. Um, let's uh, set that off. Uh, hello. Series? <laughs> I'm going in series. Uh, let's uh, whack that off. Where is the speedometer? That's a very good point. Speedometer's there. Hopefully we get going. I want to get that off first, actually. Uh, just feeling one hundred percent fair enough. Uh, night tracks. Try to take it easy. Hello, Matthew. I'm all good. How are you? Just but just West Cornwall local. Awesome. Uh, Avenue. How are you? Are we gonna go? Huh? Why are we changing to diesel? I've not driven this one before, so why are you in emergency? Get back into there. It's not going well, is it already? <laughs> Hold on a sec. Yeah, I've never driven this. First time driving this. Let's put it into parallel. See if that does it. Oh, there we go. That's better. Not really know why we are on diesel, but 
we can do diesel. It was uh, it was good, uh, Gordon. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Three on three. Out we go. Yeah, I mean, shouldn't it really be running on electric at the moment? You've got the third row, you've got the shoes down there as well. Yeah, here we are coming out of Victoria. Here we go. ProMods is taking a lot of FPS on my PC, so I thought of getting E Roadnet on my ETS2. Have you tried it? I haven't got a clue what that is, <laughs> Avnish. I know what ProMods is, but not. Um, e Roadnet. I'm guessing it's similar to ProMods. Is this supposed to be a rail tour service? No, this is a, just a normal service. Or well, scenario. Afternoon, William. I'm good. Glenn, don't worry. I will get a flyby shot through the uh, infamous station. Yeah, and then we'll do this, uh, the scenario going back in the 489. Do that next. So we do, have, do we have to pop that up at some point then, to series? <clears throat> yeah, I do know the front main on speed limits and stations and all that, so we'll keep that off. 14th of July was it? Was it that long ago? Surely it can be that long ago. Well, hello, what are you doing? What have I just done? Uh, I did something. I think I did the brakes. It's all good. We haven't stopped yet. So as engineering works, uh, yeah, I'd never go and get an express. Let's take the southern. Not a big difference, really. There's Battersea Park. Let's get a flyby shot. Let's go ahead. But yeah, I think these ran up to 2004. These did so fairly recent. Did a lateral flow and I find a negative. Awesome, uh, William. Sounds good. But yeah, we'll drive the cab car next, which is at the back. Uh, not that. Off oh, there. Cool. Let's back that up. Is that double yellow for us coming up? Possibly. No, I think we're green. So we've got 28 P points. Thanks all for coming in. Yeah, that's true, King Carrot. I suppose if you're a tourist, you don't know about the trip and how long it takes, so... But yeah, it isn't, it isn't much quicker. Cool, now up to 60 in a second. It's weird because I was only doing this journey yesterday on the Train Sim World 2 uh, route. Sort of weird to see the difference. You do like the 73, it's awesome. Yeah, but do we have to switch it over to parallel, no, series at some point? Because that would give us more power, wouldn't it? I still don't get while we're in blooming diesel mode as well. We're running on third rail. Very well to run in electric mode, fair enough. There's Clapham Junction. You do like, yeah, 73s are brilliant, aren't they? You still see them knocking about. I see them fairly regularly uh, doing the railhead treatment trains. But not in passenger service. Well, I think in Scotland they do uh, 
Is it the Caledonian sleeper they do? They're still sort of in service up there properly. But look at that. Have you tried the Chiltern Main Line yet? Not yet. Um, no, not yet. Well, at some point. All right, King Carrot. So not. What live stream are we doing for Train Some World 2? Well, if it is the case we haven't done units to Augsburg since the 14th of July, we'll get on that. I think I actually do have it installed, so that'd be alright. Coming up on Wandsworth Comment. Afternoon, Shana, how are you? The 73s do Caledonian sleeper runs up to Fort William. Ah. So they're still sort of in passenger service, but well, I suppose that is passenger service. The 90s did the Caledonian sleep. There'll be Balham next, which is just around the corner. I think it's like 600 yards or something, crazily close. There's the 70. Almost there, Glenn. Yeah, good to see Shane. I'm good. Must have been weird, though, seeing these running alongside the 377s. Yeah, because I think this went out of service in 2004. And obviously, the 377s were free at uh, 2003. So, obviously, the old 1950s train next to the modern day train. Should still have it, Shana. Yeah, should still have it. Hello, David. How are you? I did have to uninstall the Brighton main line because uh, the textures all went funny. So maybe it did get rid of it on this one. Uh, but I think it's how it should be, isn't it? For this, it's uh, three quid at the moment. Something like that. Very cheap. you got the passenger view as well, in first class. Cool. You had a random update for Northern Trans Pennine. Ah. We'll get a flyby shot in a second. Hopefully AWS won't go off. Well, I bet it will. It always happens. As soon as we want to get a nice flyby shot, the blooming safety systems go off. Just for Glenn. There it goes. Cool. Oh, in real life, uh, how much is the Gatwick Express? I'm not too sure. All I know is that it's much more than a southern uh, ticket. Here we go. The memories have uh, flooded back. Hello, Jasper, how are you? Coming up on Norbury. It's got an interesting horn, hasn't it? Get up a little. Cool. But yeah, we're going to the cab car next, which is uh, which is here at the back. We'll go in that after. It's quite cool, doesn't it? In there, quite smart baggage car. Oh, whoa, hello. Uh, not the wipers. <laughs> How do we get the wipers off? How have I managed to turn the wipers on? There. Hello, Blanos. How are you? Uh, Russian Dog, Pivots. Hopefully everyone's all well. You think I'd buy an EVA game? Should I buy a train somewhere to Brighton Mainline or Railroads Online? Um, 
Well, it's up to you, really. I don't really know. Um, I do want to get railroads online myself. Tough decision. I mean, I would say the Brighton Mainland, but that's a bit biased as it's the Brighton Mainland. Um, that's, yeah, I don't know. Oh, they survived. That's good then. Um, pet. Uh, tried my gear lever for my G920 yesterday on Forza, and I can go proper cruising. Awesome. What is your favourite train horn? Uh, I don't really have a favourite train horn. Nah, don't really have one. Well, I do like the javelin one. But I wouldn't say I have a favourite. And yeah, we'll, uh, we'll look at getting the Thumper as well, the 205. Uh, which I think it comes in Network South East livery. I'll try and get that one next. To Selhurst. Yeah, it's weird to see the differences between this one and the Train to More 2 version. Because this one's set in, I think, 2011, 2012. Uh, whereas the new one is modern day. There's been quite a few changes. Gatwick, the most noticeable, and East Croydon. Get that on. 20 quid is it? Give me an egg. I think I'm going with railroads online since I've been into steam trains lately. Fair enough. Oh god, bedside table thingy. Here we go. Yeah, it's uh, folds out, legs, bit going across the top. You know, you put a laptop on it, the bed table thingy. Yeah, East Croydon looks like a proper state, doesn't it? The station. Oh, this is 2012. It's uh, it's different now. Looks a bit nicer. Fair enough, uh, Russian dog. That would be cool, though. Backdated Brighton Main Line. I mean, the amount of trains, and that would be brilliant. You could have the 73, you could have the 319. You could have the Southern Slammers, sort of said it, maybe 2004. So you get the 377, the Southern Slammers, I can't remember what class they are, like the 4, 6 something. Um, and yeah, 319, 74, it'd be brilliant. That would be something I'd like to see. That was the bed table thing you made out from. Uh, would, I guess. through night tracks very similar yeah that's a good point who would like to see uh, four two, possibly then but then, yeah possibly that's through night tracks the 460 well then what would you rather the 460 or the 73 so I suppose if you said it 2005 you'd get the 460 and then 2003 slash 4 you'd get this but who'd like to see that? A backdated Brighton mainline route. Where you had 377, uh, this train, um, oh, we got a trophy. The 319 as well, it would be heaven. And the old slammers. <laughs> Lovely Russian dope. Did you see my question? Uh, let me scroll up. Uh, your question. What would your favourite train be out of all the companies? Probably the 377. My opinions on Railway Empire, an addicting game. Yeah, it's fun. Once you start building, you just can't stop. <laughs> What's that bed, uh, bed table thingy? Got enough Blockland? We are whizzing along. I should add the Mallard to train some more, that'd be cool. Fair enough, Blockland. I mean, steam is coming, so you never know, maybe at some point. 
So Glenn, how does it feel to see this back in action? Oh, ladies, yeah, the 319 is is lovely. Let's go ahead. Your favourite train's biased. Oh, a seeking carrot. Right, let's watch it going past. Look at this. I don't know why the track's missing there. <laughs> What's my opinion on the class 755? Is that one of the new... Uh, was it Greater Anglia, East Anglia ones? The Stadler ones. Is that the 755? Haven't been on it, but from what I've seen it looks quite cool. Seems to have quite good uh, sort of reviews of it. Fair enough, Glenn. So we're about, what, 10 miles now from Gatwick, and then once we get to Gatwick we'll go into the original scenario and go back to uh, Victoria. Revolutionary. <laughs> I've heard the 357s are uh, getting bed table. Oh, are they King Carrot? How convenient. <laughs> That'd be cool for bidding. I mean, I wonder if they will do a Heritage Railway for the first steam route. I haven't been on the 755, but from what I've heard, uh, apparently they're yeah, really good. Yeah, you can pick this deal, DLC up for, I think, three quid at the moment. Um, so if you haven't got it, um, and you've got the Brighton Main Line, definitely worth it. Remember, this is Train Simulator, not TSW. Oh, it's lovely, pet. And then down into the quarry tunnel. Why hasn't Dovetail done C2C yet? I suppose I haven't got around to it yet. Might not even have the license. Fair enough, King Carrot. That would be alright, though, night tracks. Wouldn't mind that. I mean, it would suit it, wouldn't it? So, but you would have to do a whole separate timetable, as the current one's supposed to be set on a diesel gala. Got the three five seven block then. Well, it's not the three seven nine. Yeah, three seven nine's name. Awesome King Carrot. I mean, C2C is sort of in the game. Um, obviously, on South East and High Speed, you get the C2C lines going going past. But obviously, it's not. But you do see where they run. You can't even feel the speed in this. So we're pretty much out of London now. Here's the M25. There it goes. So the amount of players own that route, not all. Fair enough. Or maybe like a re-release of the West Somerset Railway. That West Somerset Railway in brackets steam, and it's got all the water towers. And I doubt that would actually happen, but uh, the 377 dash drives on South Eastern are full of tables, and every carriage take that seat to see. Uh, they could add the channel tunnel to TSW and make like the CSX thing where you transport cars. That would be cool for bidding, but then that would be quite a boring route. 
you'd just be in the tunnel the whole time. Well, it'll still be cool though. Hey, Para, how are you? See, it says also can to can. I thought the cab light was. I thought it was quite light in the cab. There we go. Let's give that off. Yeah, that would sort of make more sense, wouldn't it, Damien? Hasn't someone made Ashford to Lille in TS already? I believe they have. Yeah, I've seen quite a few uh, sort of videos quite recently about the uh, Channel Tunnel route. Awesome Russian Doke. Lovely train, look at that. It's awesome. Uh, Southern Railway Class Four today would be an interesting addition to the game. Bit of a hang oh, power. Uh Trying some coffee at the moment. I'm guessing uh, last night's uh, meal went down quite a treat then, Power. Hello, Magnum. Today you're doing a, a London to Rainham speed run in a 442. Lovely. Is that a talent too? Or, or a, a Wessex pig? This is Salford's coming up, and it's Hawley, then it's Gatwick. Hey, Lewis, that's weird. I was just thinking, I wonder when Lewis is going to come in. I wonder if Lewis will come in. That was, that was weird. See you Jasper, thanks for coming in mate. Hello Ethan, you're good, good to hear, I'm good. Plastic pigs obviously. Let's get back in because we are going to get AWS very shortly. Just letting it naturally come down for now. That would be cool, uh, forbidden. Right, let's start popping that down. Had lots of Italian bubble wine. Lovely power. The full Italian, then. Doesn't actually have an official meaning. Most say city to coast and capital to coast, and some even say commitment to customers. Yeah. I mean, probably capital to coast, that sort of sounds the most but what it would be. But does anyone remember, I know Glenwell, when, um, when these used to run? Yeah, it was fairly recent, 2004 I think, uh, when these did go uh, out of service and then the 460s come in. And then obviously then it was the 442, and now it's the 387. Here's Hawley. Awesome pet. And class 492, the double decker slammer. Yeah, that was like the 1950s, wasn't it? Double decker. Mm -hmm. 
73s are still used on freight quite a bit. Yeah, you see them on the RHGT trains quite a bit. But quite a few bases, well, they were based at Horsham, I don't know now, but they need to bring them back. Alright, Pivers. One day we'll be able to do it on ATS. I don't know, uh, King Carrot. Your TSW looking kind of funny. Gatwick missing a whole platform. Yeah, we are. Gatwick Airport, the old Gatwick Airport. Well, still the same place, but has platform 7 now. So what do we count as? Uh, I guess we're stopping on the 8 to 6. I think we've got 5 coaches behind us and the loco, so pretty much 6. Don't think we need all the platform, will we? That should do. Here we go, Gatwick Airport. Yeah, we fit on easily. That was a brilliant run, that was. Get that on. Coffee's working, lovely power. Uh, and you sometimes see 73s on the test trains, but mostly 37. Yeah, we'll go back to Victoria now. Yeah, we'll do it in the cab car end. Which is equally as cool. Hold well on driver, that was a successful run, thanks to uh, you many pleased passengers will be glad to have made their flights, let's review your performance. F1 burned out. Okay, we didn't do very good, we got 484 XP. <laughs> oh wow, okay. Yeah, it's so good. Um, right, career. Uh, 73... Which isn't actually in the 73. We'll do this one. The first 30 seconds of this scenario are in the 73. How do I stream from Xbox? No clue, those are yet. Um, I know you can to Twitch, I think. Right, we already read that, didn't we? Being re Pretty much we're going on the slow line because it's busy and engineering works. Open the doors. Let's get the uh, tail lights on. There we go. Uh, and then switch cabs. That's all you do in the 73. We are on the other end. It's, it's a beautiful looking train, though, isn't it? You're doing 103 miles an hour and a 40. Blimey, Magnum, testing it to the limit. Uh, I don't think you can, laser jet. That's like me on flights and being that high up coming into Gatwick. Liam Championship, I know how Lewis Hamilton feels now. Hello, Kobe, how are you? I'm all good. Right, there we go. Let's get going. Uh, we'll go in slow line. Yeah, fast to Victoria. Let's go. Further horn on this end. Another 73. Oh, that's lovely night tracks. Blimmin' lovely. Yeah, not too sure, Lazer Jet. Just brilliant, Russian Dog. APT things.
Ah, that's a single yellow coming up, so let's speed up a little bit. From what era are these trains on the Brighton Main? Like fairly recent, uh, well modern era. This is uh, pre-2004. I can't remember when they first started running on the Brighton Main line. I'm guessing maybe 80s, 70s, 80s. No, but they lasted until, yeah, 2004. Oh, late 90s, 2004. Yeah, so fairly, you know, modern era. Is West Coast Way on here? Sort of, but then not. There's like a mod for the West Coast way, but there's like no scenery, so it's uh, it's not brilliant. But I mean, the Brighton Main Line, the best period for the Brighton Main Line must have been sort of 2004, 2005, where you had all the different, you had the modern and old trains running together, the 377, the 319, well the 319s went, you know, up to 2000, but they're still running today, not on the Brighton Main Line. But they went in two, 2015 from here. Get yourself out. I probably do need a haircut, yeah. Probably King Carrot. Yeah, the 319, the, um, the 73, uh, the 377, the Slammers for the Southern. It must have been brilliant. Oh, did it? Or was it Kobe? Ah, oh, see, pet. I need to over then a portal. Lovely night tracks. Unfortunately, as I was only one or two, uh, I I don't remember it. <laughs> I, mean, I might have, and I've seen the train, but I can't remember. So I was so young. Brilliant. There hasn't really been like a another sort of transition period since, has there? Really? I mean, the three one nines to the three eight sevens. I mean, I think that's just another electro star. Um, and seeing the seven hundreds come in, not really a big transition. Yeah, back then it must have been blimmin' massive. Fair enough, Damien. Set from the throttle. Yeah, fairly similar. But yeah, the throttle's just a simple, just one stick. Going through Salfords. Then we'll come down to think 75 uh, through Ellswood. Ran until 2004 as well. That must have been brilliant. Yeah, I do like 377s. I just hope trains don't go driverless in future. Because that would be like a big transition. I mean, some trains are driverless, but not really in this country. Oh, you got the DLR, but. Although, off the DLR, uh, it says it's driverless. The one time I went on the Docklands Light -like Railway, there was someone standing at the front and controlling it. <laughs> so, I suppose not completely driverless. I believe so, uh, Blockland, yeah. For our time yet. Yeah. I'll get the brakes on.
Or some Magnum. You got a bit tipsy on Christmas. Fair enough, Gordon. Cool. Uh, we're a panel to control train case an emergency, yeah. Fair enough, uh, night tracks. I mean, yeah, driverless trains, it just, it's not right. It, it just doesn't seem right. It just, I don't know, it would just make trains boring if they're driverless. You sort of just see a train and it'll be like, oh, there's no driver and that, we're not getting any horn from that. It's, it's be boring. And who the hell wants driverless trains? Enough block flint. Well, actually, the 700s are sort of driverless going through the core section, but I mean, that is understandable. It's very, very busy. Lots of trains need to get to where they need to be. and this Red Hill? Does this train have a bedside table thingy? Um. I suppose, yeah, it does. It actually looks quite similar, I guess. Well, it doesn't go wide that end, but it does. <laughs> Moving in onto the main line. It does, yeah. Fair enough, Damien. But then with sort of metros, it's, you know, a driverless metro is. It feels different to a sort of a driverless mainline train. You sort of get what I mean. <laughs> Although still, when there's a driver it's always better. Driver Victoria line, so oh up by me. That must have been good there. Uh, well, fun to see uh, night tracks. Well, brilliant to see. You're on the Arose line, awesome, Sebastian. Cool. What uh, was that? Um, something about the Stadler Metro just don't look right to me, driverless or not. I still prefer the old Metcam cars, fair enough. Oh, it's lovely, Kobe, isn't it? Fair enough, Russian Doke. Yeah, fair enough, King Carrot. I mean, yeah, sort of metros and, you know, just small little networks. Yeah, them being driverless, fair enough. Um, but, you know, main, mainline trains, no, they can't be driverless. Sort of like the tube network, if that was driverless, well, some of it already sort of is. You know, I'm not going to mind too much. Most of it's in a tunnel, but yeah, also a mainline train where you're going to notice it even more. Nah, not that. Even Noah, how are you? Do you own the 442? Uh, yes, I do. The only Gap Express I don't own on this game is the uh, 460. <laughs> Everyone is obsessed, pal, with the bed, bed, uh, bed table thingy. Plus, by making driverless trains, you then sort of cut so many jobs out, which is obviously not what we want at the moment. Well, I suppose you do create more jobs by having driverless trains. Well, it sort of just replaces drivers with technicians or whatever that would be, programmers. But still. <laughs> Get 
great physical academy, John. Yeah, enjoy the 73, it's brilliant. brilliant. I never started that. Yeah, that's true, night tracks. For closest to fit with platform edge doors driver, this is fine, yeah. Because that'll be fairly hard for the driver anyway. So I sort of line it all up with the doors and started that trend. Glenn started it, King Carrot loves to continue it. <laughs> Next ETS run, we should deliver bed table thingies, yeah. Maybe that's what the gifts are. I swear the cab, is the cab light on? It is. Seems to sort of default be on, or by default be on. Fair enough light tracks. What's the stream schedule for today? Um, this stream and then TSW later bit more of a chilled sort of time you know between Christmas and New Year a bit more chilled out fair enough Damien I'll ask a question how long do you think the IETs will last 20 years tops I mean, the Electro Stars have already been going almost 20 years, which was weird to say that. They've probably got another 20, 30 years ahead of them. Yeah, good to know I'm good. What's for tomorrow? Uh, we've got Euro Truck Simulator 2, which is Andy's request. Uh, and Train Some World. Maybe we'll do another stream tomorrow, a third one, on something. Enough Blockland. Here we can have four years. 45 years, that's ambitious, uh, ladies and gentlemen, for the IETs. And they've only been around sort of two years and they're already getting cracks. 25 to 30 years. Yeah, fair enough, night tracks. So let's take it as easy as you can. Blimey, Magnum. I <laughs> just use a coffee table. That's the spirit power. Maybe ATS again so you can deliver the presents and make it a trucking day, maybe. It was quite fun on ATS yesterday. We're heading to London, Victoria, James. enough Ethan so you have reminded me Pivers I believe cross play is back now for FS22 so in fact I might do that tomorrow as well as well as ETS as well Just a little bit, Pivus, just a little bit learned. But working our way through. Fair enough, uh, Magnum. So it looks like we're going back onto the uh, fast lines. Should I buy a new Mexico for a few? I'd say just buy all the ATS and ETS DLCs, map extensions. They're all worth it. Awesome, Gordon. Oh, wow. Forbidden. That would be uh, something. Hello, John. How are you? Good afternoon. Fair enough, Noah. Yeah, I thought it was 70 across these. Is that 70 or 40? I can't really see it sort of doing weird things at the moment. It is 70. I thought that was the case. That's a good laser jet. Uh, 
Uh, you're trying to find a scenario on the Steam Workshop um, for the AP Class 450. Uh, triple four not having any luck. Yeah. Phone numbers to quick So it's up to 90 now. What TSW route today? Well, uh, apparently we haven't done Mutes Augsburg since the 14th of July, so uh, we'll be on that. That could have been the 14th of July. It's just where we did it in like a Dosto in like September, October time. But we'll get on that. There's our 377. There. Yeah, triple four is alright. Don't mind the desiros. That'll be the warning for the sixty. Oh, but I'm your magnum. Hey, munchies, how you doing? That's true, forbidden. Uh, could do those as yet. We'll wait and see. That's another 377. That is a dash 2, so that should have a pantograph on it. I should have a dash 2 on there, was I like seeing things? I think it was a dash 2. Is this available on Train Sim World 2? Uh, no. This is Train Simulator the 73. Down to 45. Possibly make them. <laughs> uh, I see munchies. Should be a fairly quiet day, I guess. Well, we're going through platform two, so we don't need to go down to 30 miles an hour. Yeah, platform two. Cool. Step 45. I can't figure out how to use my AP scenarios, which came with the 450 triple four. Uh, they're probably on the standard, yeah, probably on the standard um, scenario section. Um, you should see them on there. And make sure you've got the right route as well, as they might be for I don't know the Bournemouth to Southampton one. Hey, are we going back onto the slow line? Well, I think we are as well. Oh, back to, uh, yeah, back on the slow ones. Oh, I see Pep. Did anyone actually ever go on one of these? 
I know people have seen them, but did anyone go on them? Oh, I see, yeah, uh, forbidden. How much is BML on TS at the moment? It's always cheap. Uh, I'll probably about four or five quid. It's always cheap. Are we going through Selhurst? That banner repeats is telling me the signal's red. Oh wow, for a second I okay yeah, we're all good. I thought we were going straight across them. Yeah, we're all good. That was a bit of a weird diversion, though. Eh? Uh, do you have the East Coast Man London to Leeds and York merge? Uh, no. Yeah, it was good, John. What about yourself? Yeah, it's usually cheap. That's not bad, 13 quid. What'd you get the 442, 73, 460 for that? What country are you in ETS right now? Uh, we're in Austria. Austria, yeah. Uh, honestly, it's been way too much on train simulator add ons between Steam sales and AP sale. My wallet hates me this Christmas. I don't blame you, Night Tracks. The brilliant stuff. Hey, Adman, afternoon, how are you? Oh, uh, no, you need the South London network for that uh, Russian dog. And then, it, once, you've get, once you've got the South London network, you can then go onto the Steam Workshop, look up London to Brighton, uh, and then it will come up with. No, uh, South London to Brighton. And there's a mod where it merges the two routes together. That's good, Mr. Quicko. Yeah, the little tiny town next to Graz had a really long name to it. Yeah, good to hear, man. To sure, Russian dog. Uh, have you got the requirements for it? I guess you do if you've got it. Blimey, Magnum. That is a speed run and a half. Um, do you already own a couple of the bits in it? Possibly. Blockland? Yeah, I might not let you because of that block and possibly. Do you want me to open a factory for bed table thingies? Everyone's obsessed. <laughs> yeah, not too sure Russian dog, mate. 
Uh, was the 73 the Dovetail games or the Master Key version? Uh, just the, I it was the Dovetail one, Ant Man. Yeah, it was on the Steam store, only for three quid, so I thought well, I'll pick that one up. Is it not there, uh, Permian? Someone did mention that earlier. I mean, I did have to uninstall the Brighton mainline. So maybe it has uh, sort of screwed it up the way I installed that. Well, installed it, then installed the AP track pack, then uninstalled this. So it might have screwed it up some way. Awesome job. So I suppose it'll probably be alright for the other routes. That's weird, you can see that the track loading in. That's weird. Right, let's speed up. That's the original. Uh -huh. Well, yeah, I had to uninstall the route because all the, the ground textures weren't there. Um, so, yeah, might have been something to do with it. Awesome, uh, Pep. And I've blocked Oh, I see, yeah, uh, Blockland. A lot of people seem to dislike the Dovetail Games add ons. Only one I really can't stand is the 180. It sounds like it painful to drive. Uh, I, just, I just get the base things, so I don't really get. I've got a couple of AP packs, uh, which I've picked up. But yeah, I, don't, I just sort of stick with the standard stuff. And there's a red light. Track render distance. Where's this Balam? Oh, we've got 33 people in. Thanks all for coming in. If you do want to see more Train Simulator, feel free to uh, subscribe. As soon as we come to a stop, it's going to go yellow. Is there DRA on this? I saw one in the 73. I don't think there is DRA. There you go, back onto the slow line again, okay. <laughs> oh, lovely Glen. 25 across here. <clears throat> Yeah, go back onto the slow line. Uh, class 460 is currently on offer, highly recommend. Yeah, I might try and pick that one up. Also, I want to get the 205 Thumper as well. Should we get... Alright, now. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah sounds good, uh, Mr. Quicko. Yeah, near Graz. There's like a town with a really long name, becoming with a K near Graz. That's where we were. Cap textures are incredible, awesome. The 205 is really food. That was really good. Did I say food? And can we try and get up to 40 likes? We've got 36 at the moment. If you do want to see more older stuff uh, in Train Simulator, do let me know. We can get, pick up a few more older bits. Like the Thumper, you can get the 421, I think. Even at that like, really old DLC, like 2010-11. That's a good point. On the Steam store, you, I think it's yeah, it's the 421. It came out in 2010, and it has screenshots of the Brighton mainline route, which didn't release until 2012. So I don't really know if it's like an old BML version. Yeah, there's another Galk Express over there. Awesome, Noah. Yeah, that's the one, Mr. Okay. Okay. Awesome, Pet. I saw one over there. I saw I saw another Galaxy Express somewhere over there. Maybe I was seeing things. I swear I saw something over there. Oh yes, here. That was one. Possibly uh, Blockland. I think it was uh, BL. See you, Magnum. Thanks for coming in, mate. Oh, that was brilliant, Mr. Cook, especially beyond the Baltics. Now you keep mentioning ETS. I might, might even get it on, on, on ETS tonight. Yeah, quite possibly. Because apparently the fast lines have engineering works, that's why we're on this line. There's a 450, I think that's actually the old 450 in the game. I think I need RSC now, Dove 2 has BML route for TS Classic. Uh. Hey Pete, how you doing? On FS22. Well, now we might do some FS22 tomorrow, Pete. Well, in fact, I think we will do FS22 tomorrow. Because I think crossplay is all working now and up to scratch, so it'll be all good. How you doing, Pete? Hopefully, you're feeling better.
How I don't, I haven't been on Halo since we last uh, streamed. I do want to get back on it. Um, yeah, at some point we will. Don't know, Mr. Quicker. I have to wait and see. Fair enough, power. Fair enough, Pep. Fair enough, fair enough uh, Pete. And we wait again. Wouldn't be waiting for that, would we? Here's the old southeastern livery. Hmm. We're gonna request this. Uh, which should be tab. Tab. No. I don't know what we could be waiting for. Ah, oh, possibly that. Awesome pet. You're in Germany, awesome uh Let's go. Okay. Don't know what we're waiting for. Look at that. I mean, when I press tab, nothing comes up, so I don't know if it is going to allow us through. Or if we are waiting for that. Or maybe even that. Well, that one. Oh, yeah, it probably is that, isn't it? Yeah, it probably is that train. You prefer the southeastern blue? Awesome. As we're coming back onto the fast section. Awesome livery on it, though, isn't it? Can we go now? <laughs> Hey, there we go. Hello, Kenny. Is this the AP one? Uh, no, this is uh, this is Dovetail Games. Yeah, this is the class 489, and you also get the 488. Um, I think you get the 488 with it. But what's the difference between the 488 and the 489? I'm guessing maybe there's one coach less, maybe. There's another one. No, Mr. Cook, I just haven't really. I don't know any recently because it's been Christmas, so. Yeah, not got bored of them. It's been Christmas, so I haven't really been bothered to do another one. And the last one I did was quite a big one, so. It's been taking a little break from it. And so I did. I think six scenarios for the uh, Chatham mainline, so did a fair share. I come into a stop again. Eight nine. Hold on a sec, Kenny. Let me we'll have a look at this. Let's quickly come to a stop quick. Oh, 
Oh wow, okay. Signal head is currently not working. Contact the signalman and ask for authorization to pass. The wires hanging on the front of the train. Uh, just to do the things in the train, brakes and all that sort of stuff. Couple of stuff as well, probably. Yeah, it was just after the train. Right, let's contact the signaler, which I've done. It doesn't seem to be doing it. I don't know if it, it doesn't work in this, but. Well, nothing would be stopping us. Well, I've pressed tab. So, do we go? Yeah, it's not coming up with anything. Yeah, it's him to at the back. Well, I'm pressing tab and it's not doing anything. So, do we risk it? I say we do because the nothing would be stopping us from going in. Let's see where this is going. Where are you going? Maybe we have to wait for this one. No, it's going that way. That's how we risk it, I think. Yeah, that one's already there. That one's already there. Yeah, I think we should uh, do it. Right, we might get a spad, but um, I, it did say press tab, and I've pressed tab, and it hasn't come up with anything, so. Yeah, so we might get a spad, but if we do, we did press tab. Yeah, signal pass. So actually, what we can do is, how do you, what was the thing to do it? No, you can't. Well, that was weird, because we pressed tab and it didn't come up with anything. Which was weird. Um, well, that is going to be it. <laughs> um, that is going to be everyone for today's uh, TS Brighton Mainline stream. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. That was a return from London, Victoria, to Gatwick, and then back. Uh, from what's Iberia DLC, looks quite good. Reminds me of ATS of the Long Highways. Fair enough. Uh, you will find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the page. So, wait... Way, oh, it's a bit late now. But it did say press tab, didn't it? It said contact the signal, which I did, and it didn't come up with anything. So I, I don't know. But that's going to be it, everyone, for today's Train Simulator live stream. You'll find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Apart from that, uh, get close to the signal and tab. Oh, <laughs> a bit late now. Uh, that was a 73 Kearney with the 489. Uh, hopefully, we'll see you in the next one. See you all, and take care. Bye, guys.